Hello and this is me again, Benson. Welcome to another video in quite some time, actually. Not quite some time. It was just like um a two-day break, maybe. Yes. But um <clears throat> we're here today. There's nothing exciting for the intro today, nothing or whatever. If you didn't catch the announcement I made in the last video, go check it out now. And uh yeah, let's just jump right into this. So we're doing the multiple earth and the hollow earth theory today so my theory at least on the universe mostly i guess you could say that's what it is ex minus the hollow earth um thing i mentioned it a few good times in the last video yeah last video which is about the deep ocean theory and uh oh, excuse me but um uh, i lost my train of thought now oh that mentioned it a few good times in the um the previous video from before the deep ocean theory about the hollow earth and the multiple earth so let's just jump right into first into the multiple earths theory now i said that there could under the oceans there could be creatures that exist on our planet maybe maybe that defy um logic i guess yet yeah, that defy physics and anything else like creatures that are um like a few good sin um meters tall like a 500 meters 30 meters tall or something and creatures that have multiple limbs like wings i guess like two no it's four legs and two wings so that that kind of thing and creatures with multiple heads larger smaller other um physical other strange attributes i guess like just giant monsters like uh, giant monsters i guess could exist on the earth now the idea of that is that, like, science says creatures like this can't exist, like Godzilla, if he was to exist, his bones would be have to made, be made of metal because he can't support his own weight, which is kind of bullshit to me. So that's why we, it, when you think about it, if there could be a fictional, maybe real planet um, with uh, dinosaur-sized creatures that don't have eyes, they use, um, have no ears really or any kind of functional things that don't look they look like things from earth but they're not like um 100 percent that they're very alien looking like if you have creatures that looked and look and seem different ways then why can't there be other planet other different earths around that we probably don't know that have creatures that exist like like again godzilla or larger creatures or maybe there's another planet with like um high low uh, car like high carbon dioxide like back in the precambrian era where there was giant spiders and millipedes and dragonflies and shit flying around like why can't there be earths in different not dimensions i'm trying to keep away from that because that'll be too silly in different galaxies um besides ours that could exist and inhabit different kind of life forms maybe creatures that don't have cells maybe creatures that are taller than a building creatures that um are like bioluminescent creatures that don't have mouths but they eat some other way and some and so on i guess you could just come up with the rest if you know what i mean but but yeah i don't know uh what else about the i keep wanting to say how about earth the multiple earths there's so that's how i see it if you could have or like um like not darwin four i just said that um Oh, what is it? In not Turok. I'm all over the place. Uh in Avatar, their planet there. Um I forgot what it's called now. I'm drawing a blank. Um like that kind of planet. Like why can't there be a planet like that that holds animals with multiple limbs and they have a different way of breathing or living, functional, like biological and other kind of um attributes they look like creatures from earth but they're not a hundred percent that like i just said earlier so why can't there be earth like that or maybe there's earth with no humans or maybe there's another dominant species on like different earths and different galaxies but i'm done talking about that so let's now yeah i think that's it let's get away from space and go back to earth for a little bit our earth right now so as i said um the hollow earth theory um as i said and I know I'm like doing rambling run on sentences, but I just am trying to explain this the best I can off the top of my mind, how I 
Skimmy decided this. So I mentioned in the previous video that, or maybe I did um, for a few seconds, is that our Earth could be, like, not what we expect it to be. Maybe creatures from those planets I just said are probably living on the Earth, but they're right underneath our feet, maybe. So, um, like, there could be a layer of, like, lava, magma surrounding that, but then in the center, instead of a little shit ball, maybe there's, like, prehistoric... Another, like a lost world, like journey to the center of the earth kind of shit. Like there's probably like, like cre like giant monsters down there or something. Other alien like creatures or things like that are on the earth, like a, like a giant lizard or something, or maybe like a pterodactyl or some other strange creatures that um are living under the earth. Or maybe there is no lava down there at all, and it's just a hollow center area where everything in there is living inside the core of the earth and they could just come out through holes whenever they want like i guess like some skull crawler kind of shit um like kong skull island but um yeah i don't know uh what else about um the hollow earth theory it's just the idea that maybe what um we think about our center of the earth that we know is probably wrong and there's things that are probably living in the uh the center um of the earth instead of um lava magma and uh, a tiny metal ball that's the center of the earth that's just this big um ouch there's probably um other things living inside like the um the center of the earth but yeah i think that's it yeah that's it i don't have nothing else to say if you guys agree with my theories um here let me know in the comments if you disagree and you have a different opinion or an idea just let me know i would definitely take a gander at it and uh i don't think i have anything else to say i think there might uh, oh yeah there, i think there might be be two um uh videos oh the planet's name is pandora i just remember now um there might be two videos for today this one and another one coming after it i think Unless if that works out. So, yeah. Yeah, I don't think I got anything else to say. So, yep. So, hope you guys enjoyed the kind of share. And subscribe. Thumbs up. Thumbs down. Watch videos. And hope to see you next time. And I don't have anything clever to say really right now. But I guess the cool, the best thing I could do is this.